So one clue given in this question is that the area of one square is 64 cm square. So in order to find the length of one side of the square, we will take square root 64, which will give us 8 cm. So this is the length of one side of the square. And part A asks us to find the area of the shaded region. So in order to do this, we can rearrange this diagram to help us find the answer more easily. By flipping this square upwards, we can get this rectangular shape. This will be the shaded region. Since just now we calculated that the length of one side of the square is 8, I'll label it here. And we also know that the length of this entire side will be 16. So if this is a square, this side will also be 8. Okay? Now, in order to find the area of the shaded region, we will take the area of the rectangle, subtracting off the area of the semicircle, and that will leave us with the area of the shaded region. So the area of the rectangle can be very easily found by 8 times 16, which gives us 128 cm squared. So this will be our rectangle. The area of the semicircle can be found by pi times the radius times the radius times half because it is a semicircle and this will give us 148 sorry 100.48 cm square and this will be the area of the semicircle so the area of the shaded region can be found by taking this subtracting off this you will get 128 minus 100.48 and the answer will be 27.52 cm squared. So this is our answer for part A. Now moving on to part B, it asks for the perimeter of the unshaded region. The unshaded region. So that will be this side, plus this side, plus this side, and also this side, plus this side, plus this side. Since we know this length is already 8, and there are a total of 4 of it, we can find 8 times 4 giving us, giving us 32 cm. For the curved side, these two sides will add on to give us half of the circumference of the circle, which can be found by pi times the radius of the circle. So this will be the sum of the two curved sides and it will equal to 25 on 1, 2 cm. So the total perimeter of the unshaded region can be found by adding these two together. 32 plus 25 on 1, 2, which will give us the answer of 57 on 1, 2 cm. This will be your answer for B.